SUNY Empire State College is in the midst of it celebrating its 50th anniversary, and the Richard L. Brodsky Scholarship for Public Service exemplifies our founding principle of removing barriers to educational opportunities. The Richard L. Brodsky Scholarship for Public Service provides needed financial assistance and boosts access to college education for deserving students. It also makes it more likely that this student will succeed in their academic endeavors here at Empire. Thank you, Chancellor, for creating this scholarship in Mr. Brodsky's memory and for your broader leadership in driving academic opportunity for students throughout New York State. It feels good to be home. I said it when I took the presidency and I still mean it today. This is the college that's going to lead the way in the future of higher education. This is where higher education is going. Richard was a mentor of mine and he was a mentor of many people in public service. He was known as Albany's conscience. We were honored that last year we could start the Richard Brodsky Scholarship for Public Service. We were able to already give one scholarship last year. Today we're announcing the second round of the scholarship. It is a $1,200 award um, to a student that they could use for tuition or books or other educational expenses. The students have to be committed to public service. They have to show leadership qualities and they have to have a GPA of 3.0 or higher. There is no better place than Empire State College than to house this scholarship because Richard was a tenacious, some would say pugnacious, sort of public official. He spoke his mind, he spoke it strongly, but he always spoke it for the right reason. But more than that, he trained generations of individuals like myself and others um, to enter public service because it was the right thing to do. Our goal was to help people. Um, and by the way, that's the mission of Empire State College. How do you pr provide access to help more people? So there's a beautiful linkage between Mr. Brodsky's career as well as what we do here in the mission of Empire State College. I've worked for the New York State Legislature in the Senate and the Assembly side. So I really do, um, you know, stand in agreement with what the Chancellor stated about Assemblyman Brodsky. He definitely was a man with strong convictions. One of the great things about SUNY Empire is that it is for non-traditional students like myself. Um, I'm a single parent of four, and this is my very first attempt of getting my bachelor's degree. Um, it took me a very long time because I was a single parent and children have to come first. Education is important, knowledge is power, and no one can ever take away what you know. But now I have to be that mother that has to show integrity and be parallel. I just thank God for people like um, my mentors and you know people within Student Empire that have supported that vision, have supported that goal, and being able to do that with finances makes it possible. So I really, really appreciate a chancellor that just really not only just says he believes, but he puts forth the action about what his beliefs are. And that is what it's all about. It's about you and your determination. Um, and thank you for uh, telling us your story because it is difficult. And the fact that you persevered through all of that and you're achieving your dream of education, that deserves another big round of applause. Let's give Grant and another big round of applause.